Max here and today we are making another Dragon Adventures video because today I have found out that they have the winter event which I'm like whoa okay <laughs> I don't know how long it will last I know someone asked me that today in the game because they realized who I was and I like do you know how long how long this event will be going I was like I have absolutely no clue and I was <laughs> they're like oh all right <laughs> but anyways this is new honestly what is like, what? what does the lock thing do? Does that keep others? Oh, so it looks like that to other people. <gasps> That's cool. Okay. Well, I don't really see why I need to lock anybody out because, you know, usually people could come in here as they please. So, you know, they can chill if they want to. But this is here now. I like this. I don't have to go over and pick the plants no more. I can just, like, you know, claim the plants. All right. So, before we go to Tundra and all that, I got a few potions from trying to get the dragon. I didn't get the dragon. I'll have to make a video on that if I do, which I feel like should be able to get it. Probably not with how hard it is to get, but, you know, we can try. Anyways, we're gonna go try once in Tundra, and then I also want to do, like, the potion thing, so I gotta get out three dragons i'm willing to get their colors changed and then who else would i like here we go yo get out of the shot like everyone's so much smaller than you you're like crushing their self-esteem okay no stop i don't like when you're all just getting all mixed up like stand here i why you guys gotta be so mean to me when I'm trying to make a video. Okay, stand there. All right, so we got this one here, my little mutt boy here, and this one I've had for a long time because I felt like I should just have a Drake for some reason. Anyways, I got three different potions from this event. I also have a bunch of, like, icicles and these uh, Aurora Borealis jars, which I have no clue what those are for or if I'm supposed to just sell them, but I'm going to keep them because, like I said, I don't know. I have a personality potion. I also had, why I can't think, <laughs> a material shuffle potion. Once again, I used it on Apple. You see, he's, his colors, they change, and I actually like them this time, and I'm probably not going to mess with them again. So, yeah, because I actually like them, and I'm, like, too scared to, like, mess them up. <laughs> but anyways... We have the Aurora Borealis Potion, we have the Frostbite Potion, and this. So I don't know what these two do- I just said do. I can't. What these two do. So I'm gonna try to use these ones. I'm scared. <laughs> but we're gonna try it. First, we're gonna use this one, probably on the Mother Dragon, because, you know, if it's something good, I want it to happen to this one something bad oh well <laughs> can't say i really like this one anyways i'm sorry i love you still all right here we go ah da. you know what let's just click feed there we go now put this away so what does it do though oh boy oh boy <laughs> it gives them oh my god that's cool wait stop moving oh <gasps> Okay, look at this. Okay, now if we fly. Oh, Aurora Borealis. Woo! Okay, so for some reason, I thought that was a color changer. Apparently not. That's cool, though. Okie dokie. I like that. So we'll put you away since that happened. I like that. Okay, you. So do I want to use a color shuffle thing on you or what? Nah, I'll use the frostbite on you, though. Actually, yeah, here. You know, I don't think- One day, I'll have to get a color shovel potion for you. Like, you're a little funny, but you know, we still love you. Alright, put that one away. Get you back out here. Frostbite. Ooh, now let's see what this looks like. Wow. Ooh, okay, that one's cool. Jeez. <laughs> okay, then. I like that. That actually kind of fits you, though. Like, the eyes are kind of, like, a purplish color. Yeah, they're, like, a dark purple, but still. And then the blue. Ah, uh, that actually kind of fits. You know, you're staying. Your colors, I'll probably change them anywho. Which, you know, they can stay for now. Uh, you. So, I used a color potion on you so many times. Like, everybody here knows that by now that I have used this on you. But, anywho, let us use this one. The Christmas one. Ooh. 
and feed it to you and we can put it away because we have another one get you back out oh okay hello oh yeah <laughs> christmas colors i like this honestly though the red and the green and the white beautiful yay then also if i feel like it like for random i guess dragons that have like weird elements i was forgetting what they're called <laughs> i could give them like the aurora borealis or the frostbite you know now they can be cool like you i could give you something other than grass but i feel like grass kind of fits them here for this one though i can give wait this one has abyss right yeah we could give you instead of abyss we could give you a uh, bro where is it at <laughs> the frostbite one because i feel like that one would probably fit it a lot better here and then we'll put candy away i have to change their names but you see now the dark blue just oh yeah it looks better i like that okay so now that we've done that we can actually go to the tundra and check things out yay i just really wanted to check the potions out but i didn't want to like do them without like making a video about it because you know like it could have been something cool which it was and like i only have a few potions so i didn't feel like going to waste all my potions on a bunch of like dragons and whatnot because you know sometimes like i have like a bunch of halloween potions but i don't really think like i really want all of them to be used on like the same dragons so they all have like the same colors or something like that but anyways here's this wheel i can't spin until another uh 19 hours <laughs> But here it is. This is like the stuff you can get, but it also switches. Like this stuff right here, it switches every so often. Like yesterday when I checked it, you could actually get the egg, which is so disappointing because, you know, I could have tried to get the egg then, but you know, I didn't. So big sad. <laughs> Because I honestly didn't know until, like, literally today. Like, oh, the egg was in shock. <laughs> but also, before this one was, there was the Aurora Borealis one was right there. So that one changes every so often. But anywho, now, so hold on. I don't know why I went with now. That was like, that was, I don't know where that sentence was going. Anywho. <laughs> So when you get in here, and if you don't know where the boss spawns, you just take your dragon. So basically where you spawn, right in front of this thing, and right where the big circle of people usually are. That's how I first figured out where it was, because I had absolutely no clue. And then I saw these people huddled up in this one area, and I was like, what's going on here? And I come over here, and all of a sudden, there's like a giant like creature and i'm like whoa okay then so we can sit here and wait with all these people and i can get out my skeleton before like at like one minute because you know this one's probably gonna die instantly like i had my raptor i didn't even heal her yet oh my god i'm sorry i just remembered <laughs> Here you go. But, like, I was using her, and she got wiped out as soon as I stepped up to beat him up. So, you know, I suggest usually using a skeleton or a mother dragon when fighting. I don't want to use my skeleton because... I mean, not my skeleton, my pumpkin, because, you know, their HP is lower than a skeleton, and they're just big babies, so we can't sacrifice them. You can use the beetle, though. Honestly, yeah, you could use the beetle. That'd be cool. I haven't seen anybody with... Oh, oh, you are the beetle. Just saw I'm talking about the beetle. I actually haven't seen anybody use the beetle at all today, though. Like, out of the whole time sitting here trying to get the egg, like, I haven't seen anyone use the beetle. Even though they literally have the same amount of HP as the mother dragon does. I love this child so much oh my god the colors are just so pretty already so let's get uh let's take out my pumpkin we'll fly around for a bit because you know we gotta wait a little bit before we can actually you know attack i guess <laughs> so let's just fly around do 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 flying honestly though i have no clue what the jars are for like all you ever ever I'll either have to, like, search it up or I'll have to, like, figure it out. I don't know if those are just for you to sell. I don't think you can use them on anything. 
I was I went right to the den place as soon as I got it to see if you know I could turn it into like a den item like the fairy jars because you know they're both jars but you couldn't do that either so I was very confused what it was really meant for also today though I met like four to five people just sitting in this circle with all these other people <laughs> I met four to five people who knew about my channel and then them like talking about my channel to each other more people found out about it and they were like oh my gosh really <laughs> it was like hello there were just so many people you don't have a tongue do you i just realized that doesn't matter you're cute anyways yay i can't i, I love the pumpkin dragon oh my god for some reason though i don't know what's up with my skeleton but every single time so like if i spawn the skeleton they will be standing but most of the time if i like just walk around with them for a while or fly with them and then i just stop moving and then i hop off they instantly go into sitting position which apparently he's not gonna do it now when i'm trying to talk about it but like every time i jump off he go right into sitting position which was odd because usually they're always just standing there and then they'll sit but he would he, see you didn't do it as quickly this time, but usually <laughs> just sit down instantly. But I like how the skeleton sits because it looks like it's sitting like this with its hands. Like as if it's kind of like holding you, but like also putting its hands together. Like that's how we feel. Like I'm being held right now or protected more like. Look at this. This is my father right here. Absolute cutie. Oh my god. Whose cutie is that over there? They're lonely. Never mind. The person's right there. Wow. I still have to grow up these children. Oh my god. Okay, so I got this one to juvenile age though. So I'm a little proud of me for that. This one. This one's taken forever though. I was trying to get it to juvenile. It just took me so long though. So, you know, we're working on that. <laughs> Honestly though, I don't see why I would need a personality potion. Like, what? What's the point of the personality potion? Like, the personality, like, it's not like you're supposed to be able to change the personality of somebody. Like, in real life, you don't just toss a potion on them and say your personality is different now. Let's see, we got mean, witty, uh, nothing, cold, energetic, serious, curious, <laughs> abrasive, confident, mean, I got so many mean ones, gloomy, spoiled, humble, negative, <laughs> anxious, impatient, spoiled, negative, angry, bored, abrasive, curious, and mean. <laughs> Dude, honestly, all my dragons are mean. Like, I don't know what I did growing them up, but they're all just mean or spoiled. The ones that were, like, read by my two dragons they usually have the better personality. Like, if I get one out of an egg or something, they're not nice. And then when I get them from other people, <laughs> they're not nice either. Like, this one was given to me and they're mean. And this one was given to me and they're impatient. This one was given to me, they're a sweetheart. This one, angry. <laughs> this one, a sweetheart. Apple Jr., I don't know when you were mean. I can't remember that, but you're mean apparently. And Bat's negative. Like, I didn't ask for your negativity bat you're just supposed to be a legit cutie but you know that changed apparently we got 13 seconds after me talking about my dragons so many people though oh my god they're so amazing they're like you inspired me to play this game when they find me in the game i'm like oh my god that's so, so sweet Alrighty, so this I'm so bad at like avoiding his attacks because before I was actually doing good where I wouldn't get hurt and the HP on my dragon wouldn't go down. Now I keep getting hit literally by everything from this guy and for some reason my fast clicker has gone so you, you know I gotta sit here and spam this mouse this takes a lot longer when there's only like this many people that's why usually in the server there's like 20 people surrounded and the guy dies in like a matter of a probably only 30 seconds but now this is probably gonna take more like a minute to kill him because you know there's a few of us here and some people just i don't understand but some people will just literally stand on the ground and hope everybody who's like defeating them will defeat it for them so then they can get the present but it does give you time 
time to like jump off and then try to go down there collect the presents honestly i try not to take that many presents though because you know there's only a few people a lot of presents do spawn but I can't say that many. Like, see, there's like 20 something people in the server and they're all trying to get the presents. There's definitely not enough. And especially for everybody who's spamming it, trying to get like more than they like should take, which you know, that it happens. Stop popping around. You're making this difficult. Like, there's only a few of us. Stop freezing us. I don't like this attack. Like, my whole, like, chat will, like, <laughs> burst up, like, with this. You can't do that while frozen. And then my notifications do that, too. Like, because I'm just, like, say, like, earlier I was just watching videos. I'm dying. Hold on. Here. This gives me time to feed you. Gives me a whole lot of time. Jeez. All right. You're healed. <laughs> But, like, when I was watching a video, I honestly, though, was just constantly spamming and, like, the notifications just kept blowing up. Like, you can't do that while frozen. I'm like, oh. Oh, his, his eyes are glowing red. Don't be angry with us. We're just hurting you so we can have dragon babies. <laughs> That's so odd, though. Come on. Come on. Ah! We're almost there. We're almost there. Okay. And go. Go, 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 go. Wait, are the presents here? The blah, 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 blah. Presents, presents. Oh, jeez. Okay, I can't see anything. There's so many dragons in the way. Did everybody get the presents? I got like three, I think. I wasn't paying attention. Let's see. I know I got another Aurora Borealis potion. Yeah. Ooh, another personality potion. When I say I wonder why I need this, they just give me another one. <laughs> This is odd. I can't- what was the other thing? I didn't read it. Probably more pears. It looks like I have more pears now, so I'm gonna assume that I got more pears. Where's my dragon? Help. Help. There you are. Like, get out of here. <laughs> Let's go back. But anyways, that was a- I don't know why I think I can like go to the spawn that way. But that was a look at how defeating the boss is and where the presents spawn because- when I first tried to defeat it and like they actually killed it, I was so confused if I was supposed to jump off or not. And I was really confused which you were getting. I didn't realize there were actual like presents you could get. I did realize that like a few times after because people were like, did you get any presents? And I was like, oh, they're presents. <laughs> but yeah, I honestly haven't been able to like get the egg, obviously, because then I would have made a thing about it. Do you have to have VIP to have this up here? Why did it just show that? It said VIP. That's cool. Is that a VIP only thing? If it is, that's something. <laughs> but anyways, let me get out my children i've used for this video so let's line you up here and hopefully you'll be nice to me which you really never are but you know we can try you're all you all have really weird colors <laughs> like all these people who have like just golden dragons or just black and white dragons like how i always have like the weirdest colors on my dragons but you know i love them they're all different they're all crazy only a few that i actually like like this one these colors mwah this one's colors, mwah! This one's colors, mwah! mwah. <laughs> like that, I love that. Oh, babies! Oh, babies! Stand up. Like, it's, it's weird if you're laying down here. I'll turn you at an angle so when you lay down, though. Anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys like this video, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe for our Blight Squad. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!